Hello and welcome. Today we're going to be looking at creating a leaf in Substance Designer and Blender. So we start just in an image editor and we cut out a leaf. We take the leaf cut out, we drag it into Substance and then we just really quickly create an opacity map in Substance by just adding in an output node and then using it in the 3D viewport as an opacity map. So yeah, um, you could do this in GIMP or, or any image editor that you wanted. You could definitely do this in something like FilterForge as well. You don't have to use Substance. We've got other tools, Crazy Bump. The important thing is here, I'm just using the bitmap to material plugin just to quickly get out a normal map and a roughness map. And I'm just using the built in range color range sliders there in bitmap to material to get to the sort of right detail point for leaf. Um, now one thing to note here is you can see that my alpha is not very clean and um, that's because I used an automated cutout tool to do it. Um, if you do your selections with pen tool and whatever tool you're working with you won't have that problem. Um, also edge feathering will be, be be better. So now I just pare it down to the three maps I'm going to use, which is roughness, normal, and color. And then I export that again as OpenEXRs. And then we head over into Blender. So now I just start by adding in a plane and setting up a basic PBR shader here. But the difference is between what I'm going to do now and what I what I was working with over in substances for the main diffuse texture I want to take that initial image and the initial alpha now that means that I can go and edit it in the image editor and come back and I can keep the same roughness and normal mapping data um, it just gives me a good way to put a combined combi a combined alpha and diffuse map together is to use that initial image. Um, so that means that I can go there and I can fix some of those bugs by just reloading. Yeah. I'm sure by seeing you get what I'm doing there. Um, so now I can just duplicate my plane. I could use this for a particle system. Um, or with the new geometry node stuff that people are doing stuff with. And um, yeah, we can um, render out some really good looking leaves. Um, thanks for watching. And I hope this has been useful for you. Goodbye.